Hey guys, welcome back. Um, this is going to be an explanation video on lasers and how the animation for the lasers aren't what actually deals damage. It's actually just when you left click to fire the laser to the reticule and you guys will see exactly what I mean when we get in here. I'm just going to use the uh, custom game lobby to get this started. All right, Q should pop shortly. We go. All right, so pop on Star Guard here. First thing we're going to shoot you, I uh, shoot you. First thing we're going to show you is um, heavy lasers with range capacitor, which have about 8,600 range, but we're just going to be a little shy of that. Um, showing you that when you left click, the damage happens instantly at that. The, uh, the animation it takes much longer to get there. And we're gonna I'll show you that with the use of feedback shield as well. And how that the damage from feedback happens immediately, not when the laser arrives at the target. The, on the only mechanical way that uh, the game actually tracks the, the speed, the visual speed of the laser is where it chooses to draw the reticule. And maybe we'll show that too. Come on, game. Let's go. <laughs> I'll be on a TZ24 Enforcer, which makes a little bit more graphical difference than the other one. I won't be doing much of the testing. You'll see. Draco, you're on a Star Guard, right? Yep, Star Guard. Stop. Are you stopped? Yeah, I'm stopped. Okay, I'm just going to move up to 8400 here. So, you can see that I'm in range, and if I fire a laser, it draws the laser, right? That just makes sense. Left click, laser fires, draws the laser to where my cursor is. So, if I fire at Otsen, just need to see that the damage is instantaneous, even though the laser has that far to travel right click laser happens so go ahead and turn um, feedback shield on i'm putting my shields to back here so that you're going to see that i'm going to take hull damage almost instantly so three two one click right where it hurts. and i take damage basically when i press left click here the other thing thing to show and now if it was based on the physical laser you'd expect a laser to have i had to transit all the way over there before he took the damage instead he took it instantly Right. If I fire on the sides of the reticule, he'll still take damage here, but beat. the laser won't won't travel through him. Hudson, can you show that back here? Fire yep. at me a couple of times. All right, this is going to be a center shot. Okay, center shot. All right, and then a side shot. Right hit. You can see that I take the damage way before the laser gets here. Okay, Give so I more just to show. Those ones aren't hitting me. So I'd like to shoot Otsin in a second once we're done here. There. There we go. Cool. Perfect. All right. So now Vrain is going to shoot at Otsin. So I want first. I want to make sure that that my laser appears to actually strike him while I'm shooting him, which it should. Ship's mm -hmm. taking a beating. Did it look like it hit him? Kind of was like looked a little bit off on my screen, but we saw the laser travel and we saw him take damage. Yes. Yeah. Now we're going to want to watch the blue of his shields. The moment I click, you're going to see the blue of his shields go down. Then a brief amount of damage, a brief amount of time later, then you'll actually see the the laser apply. So the damage should apply first. So you'll see my laser come in after. Just need damage. To hold on. Laser. I'll wait for it to go to full shield again, and then I'll do it again. All right, so he's at 100 damage, and then we saw the laser. I'm going to show another thing. Okay. So I happen to be real close to an asteroid, um, and on the TZ-24, even though your shots still take place in the center, like on every other ship, the actual physical nature of the TZ-24 is such that there's a, a, a really big wing off to the left. So I'm going to position myself so that um, Odson is 
within uh, is, is shootable by me, but not shootable by the physical laser that I'm actually firing. So you should see the damage take place. You should see me shoot and my laser stop. And then after the laser is stopped, then you should actually see um, the, uh, the, like, uh, then you should see him take damage. Let's see if I have that right. Ship's taking a beating. All right, did was did a physical laser go to him? Yes. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's still dead. Damage. Okay. Yeah, still dead. Still doing it. I didn't get a good spot. Okay. Yeah, still doing it. Okay, this laser's actually like really digging into the asteroid. I'm gonna find a different asteroid. All right, okay. do the next thing while I find a new position. Cool. So the next thing I want to show you is something that Otson just showed me today, where if you press left click on the target and then quickly drag your reticule off of it, you'll deal the damage and then the laser will fire like where your ship is pointing at the time because it's planning to shoot straight and then the laser just fires straight. So here, I'm gonna show you that. So you can see how they take damage, but the laser fires to the left. That was like really far. So yeah, and then Otson, if you could do that back, just to show them what it looks like from over here. So now I'm taking damage, but you can see the lasers are like way off. Go ahead. That was yeah. a center shot. It's hard to do. Mm -hmm. There. All right, and I'll show one more thing, Frame, before we go back to you. So if you click really quickly to fire your shot, you can actually fire an invisible shot. Now, if I'm firing a normal shot, you can see my weapon power going down just to the left of my arc, the little yellow bar. But if you click really fast, like that, see how I'm losing weapon power? Damn it. There we go, I'm losing weapon power, but there's nothing animating. I'm actually firing shots, and I'll show this to you by just need to doing it to on. Odson if I can. Of course, now it's not gonna work. God damn it. I'm gonna let you get shields and try again. It's really hard to do. You have to click super quick. Just wait for shields here. Try. I'll try to do it a couple more times off of them. Now I can't do it anymore. There we go. First try. Come on. So one out of every ten yeah, times it works out. Yeah, time. yeah. It's not. It's not a lot, but it could explain what's going on. Sixty yep. percent of the time. Right, <laughs> every time. You just did it there. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, yeah, I experienced like this actually worked better, and ironically, again. with yeah. with light lasers and rapid fires. It's actually pretty easy to replicate this if you go into the uh, uh, into the training thing because I've seen this before and I was like, "What's going on?" But no, it just doesn't animate it sometimes. It's just animation bug. All right, so All I right. think I have a position where I can damage Odson, but my laser will be visibly intersected by the asteroid. Let's watch right. the asteroid to be wrong again. All right, ready? Give it a shot. Yep. All right, Odson's at maximum shields. There we go. There we go. We saw him take damage, and his laser hit the asteroid. All right, we're gonna wait. Yeah, we're gonna wait till Odson's at full. And we're going to show that a couple more times here. All right. And then I'm going to pivot because right now I'm, I have my wing really close to the asteroid. I'm going to yep. pivot so my wing is no longer there. And then I'm going to strafe a bit closer. At that point, I will not have line of yep. sight. Won't be able to hit him, but it'll look like. A mm -hmm. So there's another shot. You saw that happen with uh, yep. the, the shield took damage. And we're waiting for it to heal again. Yep. But the actual laser bolt, the, 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 the physical animated bolt is just getting intercepted by the asteroid. This is not like an exploit or any weird thing. This is just how the game is. Because on my screen, I can see him just fine. And, like, because I'm aimed directly at him, my shots originate from the center of my screen and nowhere else ever. All right, so now I'm going to rotate 180 degrees. And then, yep. I'm, like, I'm going to strafe a little bit closer to the rock. I think that the laser will now, animated-wise, it will actually hit Odson. But physically, but, like, mechanically, it will not. The actual game mechanics will forbid them. Yeah, so now I can just hold this down. The lasers appear to be going to Odson. I, like, you know, just have to trust me here. I have him directly in the middle of the screen under the reticule, but the rock is now in the way for Odson. I'm going to show you. the middle of my screen. Yeah, I'm going to come in really close here and just show you what Farane's doing. Like, front and center here. See how the gun is on one side? See, from this angle, you can just barely not see Odson, right? But the lasers on the outside, so you see how he's. This is how he's firing, right? Right now, flip your ship. 
So now he's just making it like this so that he can see Odson. See how it's strafing in here? And now this yeah. laser is going to fire. Just need to hold on. See how it's hitting? It's hitting the wall, but Odson's taking damage. Now, again, every ship has the same exact thing. It's just a little yeah. more obvious on the Enforcer Gladiator, the model, the, the cartel type one strike model. I mean, I can kind of show it, I think, by like I'm gonna move my, my left laser hits the wall. Yeah, you can make it so your left laser hits the wall, your right laser doesn't. And rough. then you'll, he'll still take full damage. He won't take yeah. half damage from that. He'll take full. Whereas, like, as soon as I get these gray checker markers, I can hold this down. Now it's blocking all the shots. Nope. That's, sorry, the ones on the right are going through, right? Yeah. yeah it, it, on one my, laser? On, yeah, on my screen, Odson's being hit by lasers. Yeah, so that's that's what we wanted to show you guys. Anything else anyone wanted to say? Uh, just that when you uh, when you left click, it rolls dice like in Dungeons and Dragons. It basically is like roll to hit, to crit, or to miss, or evade, or whatever. And like that's what's going on. The physical objects are calculated, but they're just local, like they're just like local animations. They're not really what the real game is. They're not mechanically what's going on. They're just what's going on animation-wise. Um, if I'm going in a tight circle and shooting lasers and stuff, the lasers I see may be different than yours, just because on your screen they may shoot out at a different time. Everything's only guaranteed to be consistent on a given client. Um, the actual mechanics are consistent for everyone. On. That's the game we're playing. That's the actual GSF game. The rest is pretty graphics and stuff. All right. Thanks for watching, guys.